If we hop a few fences, we can probably get on that ride. That gate's probably just open. You ready? Yeah, let's see it. What's up, fellas? It's Monday, and we got a lot going on this week. Michael's coming in for the Creator Clash, and my car is stocked full of stuff from Easter yesterday when I went to my parents' house and got more stuff. I had been way behind on m &R Shop and whatnot orders that have come through in the meantime since I've moved because all this stuff has not been here. I wanted to wait and bring it just straight to the office space, but the office space still isn't ready, so I've broke and have brought it here so that I can still ship things in a reasonably timely manner because it hasn't been that way. Like I said, I brought a lot of stuff, so all this has got to go inside and upstairs so that it's in a nice area and cleaned up, but it's so that I can still facilitate some whatnot stuff because I am I need to. So I think I'll try to use the guest room closet as a makeshift storage area for shop stuff, and uh, that should work for now because this room is a bit of a mess right now. It's Tuesday night, which means Mandalorian season three comes out tonight and I got my boxes here. So we are gonna finish the order packing that I was doing the other day. This episode of Mando better be good. And I guess it's supposed to be with only two episodes left, but I've been kind of disappointed by how little this season feels like it's moved so far. All right, 52 minutes, I will take it. That's good. Let's see what we got. This is the way. Today I'm finally doing what I should have done a week ago and that's put away minifigures from like an old comparison video. We got the 2023 TIE Fighter set figures. I set aside these. I'm doing my uh, clone minifigure problem video today as well as the May 4th promo video today. So gonna get that done. But yeah, these and I think I already brought the ties down. I'll show y'all. Wrong room, but this is where I brought the TIE Bomber and this set that were up there for now. They need to go in these bins. I just don't know which ones they were in. And then these are going in here, wherever the 2020 summer bag is. Perfect, this one. Since Michael is coming tomorrow, I've been cleaning up. And so I've got this whole area here cleaned up from the boxes that were there. A lot of those boxes were Sands and Claire's. They've been sending their like wedding gift registry stuff to me since if they send it to their house, it'll just be sitting outside their house with no one home. And then I have the two Alex drawer boxes that I still haven't made use of. So at some point I'll put those together. So since Michael will probably want to take a shower while he's here, I figure I should put in the shower curtain I bought for the guest bathroom here, which I have done nothing with, other than film that one ad for Ask Eleanor. It's the only time I've really been in this bathroom. Now, these clearly are dated Star Wars products. I bought them probably five or six years ago when they were on clearance at Target, I think. And I bought them because I thought I would move out soon and I would need a shower curtain and a little pad thing. So that's like, I literally have had these for like five, six, maybe seven years, probably not that long, but this is Force Awakens. So it's a 2015-ish product. It just hit me that I need things to hang it with. So I'm gonna have to go to Target to get the things. Otherwise this won't actually hang. But at least you can have this nice floor pad. It looks terrible. It turns out having something bent up for seven years or whatever is probably not good for it. So this is gonna have to get thrown out. I'm gonna get more of these ones that I bought for my bathroom because they're nicer. I think it's from Target. It's nice, it's foamy. It's like heavier and not as light as the other one either. So it'll work. I went to Target and bought a ton of stuff but I totally forgot the shower hanger things. So I got, yeah, I bought a ton of stuff for when Michael's here and just things I needed and I forgot the shower curtain hangers. So have to go again tomorrow, I guess. But first I gotta pay my taxes. Let's just say Uncle Sam can buy a lot of Bio First Battle Packs. <laughs> Ooh, that sucks. Okay. Uh, well, I'm not broke, but I'm destitute after tax season. So the one thing I came for yesterday is finally in hand. I can't believe I did that, but I think I'm also gonna not do the C-3PO one. I'm gonna get this gray one. I think it'll look nicer. <laughs> storage unit going up. Well, one of these days this thing will be empty, but today is not that day. It still has too much stuff. I really want to take a gunship home and build it really, really bad, but I'm not. Not today, at least. So it looks like we still got plenty of space for more sets in here. After my first cart full, I just wanted to make sure that this stuff fits, so we'll get some more stuff and bring it up or down. The box I was hoping would fit will not fit, so uh, we will try a different box, I guess. Everything else fits better, and I cracked and got my gunship, and I'm gonna try to put it up here, because I think it will fit. We are good to go back home. We have uh, these minifigs to clean up. We've gotten this cleaned up pretty nicely, and then the other room is cleaned up pretty nicely, along with this section being nicely organized. Now I got these put in here out of my car, so 
We're looking good. Michael, did you know that this Lego set has not been revealed by Lego and that you're breaking the law by even ba bearing up, laying eyes on it? Wait, actually, literally? Don't stop looking. Um, it's all against the rules. Literally, stop. Especially against the rules. <laughs> How are you enjoying your ride to Legoland so far? <laughs> it's a great ride. Great yeah. ride? Yeah, it's really awesome. Very smooth? Oh, yeah. Have you enjoyed having just your window down the whole time? Yeah, it's nice and hot, humid, yeah. <laughs> beautiful, love Wind it. in your hair, yeah. and oh, the, yeah. it makes the seatbelt flap sound really loud. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what I actually planned to buy, but it was on our way to Creator Clash, so why not? I have genuinely never seen Legoland this busy. It is insanely packed. Luckily, we're not coming to ride rides. But like, I wanted to go on the Peppa Pig <laughs> yeah, no. ride, dude. Well, Peppa Pig costs extra. We're just here Idiot. to we're just here to spend money. Now, Michael, if we if we hop a few fences, we can probably get on that ride. With the balloons. You ready? Yeah, let's see it. <laughs> Run through the fence. Uh, we're gonna go to the bathroom. We'll show you that. Yep. Oh wait, no, we won't show you that. BLBs. And then we'll sh we'll go buy our ticket. <laughs> Michael's got his park map, so he doesn't get lost. Which way? Where are we? It doesn't show us where we're we are here, in the map. My iPhone does it there. way better. No, we're not. We're going right here. <laughs> I think they got new builds in because this looks new and not like old and decrepit. Did they paint it? Yeah, look. You can oh see my yeah. goodness. They painted it. It's not the worst thing. It looks it looks much cleaner than oh, it did. Yeah. Absolutely. Okay. Yeah, we're going to the big shop first. Welcome to the Legoland store. Oh, this is what Michael or Sans and Claire wanted a bunch of. All the. <laughs> We can try to get them for them if, if they still want them, we'll call them. But they're wanting them, them for the wedding. They want to give them out as gifts. Oh my God, I've been dying to find this book. I couldn't find it in any libraries. They still have these? Oh my goodness. Are we bad? They're $17. Oh. Yeah, even with my discount, they're like 15, 20 or whatever. And then what do they go for if you eBay? get, it doesn't matter. It's still not worth it. Cause you can go to the Lego store and they'll have them for 11, 11 99. That's why it's not worth it. Oh. Uh, looks like they don't have any good sets or anything new at all, so that's, yeah, nothing exciting for me. I do miss somewhat the joy of coming to LEGO stores and not having everything, like, as a, like, an honest note in this vlog. Like, honestly, obviously it's great to, like, be able to get everything that I want to get at this point in my life with LEGO, but there is a wonderment to, like, looking up and wanting a thing and i don't have that anymore for this this wonder woman set's like long retired oh this thing's so poorly it's the sold. box is so beat too oh my goodness it's not a bad set i think i reviewed it back in the day i liked it yeah, but it ain't it ain't that good apparently to most people next we go to the lego factory over here michael hopefully they'll have more cool unreleased stuff i thought winnie the pooh retired but they have it here for 99.99 Found a bug in here. Hopefully, I don't get that in my parts. I don't want to. I don't want that to count towards the money I'm spending to wait for for Lego parts. Ooh, I might get some of these. Part of me fears that they would see my videos and realize that they're giving out unreleased parts and stop doing it. I don't know what's unreleased, but I'm not seeing anything. I like that color. Yeah, that's pretty nice. I'm not seeing anything like front and center that screams to me like cool, unique part like I would usually see. So that's not good. I'll probably get some of these because these look helpful for something someday. Oh yeah. So I ended up getting a whole bag of these and then they have white two by fours. So Hoth is gonna be looking good. I need I need all these, or at least a lot of these two by fours. So Michael got three bags and I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven bags. I didn't fill mine up as Mike as much as Michael did though. He's he spilled them to the brim, baby. Ready to go. Oh yeah, very nice. All right, we're leaving Legoland now. I got the Darth Vader keychain because it's the oldest Lego Star Wars thing you can buy. I'm gonna make a TikTok with it or whatever. Uh, but yeah, we're out of here, right, Michael? Anything yep. else? We're done. Okay, we're off to the Lego store. Have you ever seen a display this packed? They like have every set, every set they can fit in there. It's kind of cool. I kind of like it that way. Much different than like only putting one set in there like they usually would. They have a good pick a brick here, so I'm gonna get some. I'm gonna get some pick a brick. I want. I want to get a few more different parts they have. They have some better stuff than, uh, like I'll get some of these for sure. These look cool. I don't have any of these, you know, some of these maybe. Ooh, definitely some of these. No, what the heck? These are different. Don't usually see these. Oh, definitely get some of those. On the way to Tampa, we stopped at Walmart cause they've been getting Lego sets early. So we're gonna try our luck if they have them to like do different registers so that the same manager won't be able to come at the same time. That's the, that's the ultimate plan. We're gonna get this Super Star Destroyer early one way or another. This one has a thing, like a spider, so you can't steal it, but these ones up there don't. So if you're tall enough, you're like, you could just, ready to, yeah. <laughs> oh my God, whoa. This reminds me of uh, LA, huh? Oh yeah. Kinda, no? Kinda? I don't know, a little bit. It's pretty nice. I assume on a sports game day, a little more sports, Tampa Bay Lightning, it's a little more vibrant here, like parties and music and stuff. Not a lot of that right now.
Dubs lost, and Alex Wasabi won, and Michael lost. How much money did you lose on that? Five hundred dollars. Yep. Damn, dude, five hundred dollar bet. That sucks, man. I'm so sorry. Three hundred, someone else. Yeah. So. Um. Nah, I didn't actually lose money, but we're going home. It's gonna take like two hours, and it's already eleven thirty. So that's awesome. Food rations are running low. Just straight sugar. Oh my god, just yeah, but I can eat cinnamon. It's been five minutes. We haven't moved an inch. Actually, I did move forward maybe like three inches, honestly. It's been over 20 minutes. Michael's gonna go explore. I'm putting my foot down. You better. I'm gonna make yeah, everybody know. move. <laughs> you are not. <laughs> Michael was making me listen to Umbrella, but we have made it at 155. You are literally hitting the gritty in the vlog. I'm hitting the gritty <laughs> at 155 in the morning. <laughs> 155 in the, way past your bedtime, young man. <laughs> And you got the quarter pounder with beef. Nice. It's will Don't forget your energy drink. Oh, yeah. Your face oh, drink. Face brand, guys, by the way. Oh, it's sponsored by Facebook. It's all oh, it's so cringe. It's the next morning now. Film my pirate snub fighter intro. Gonna go charge my camera while Michael and I go to Walmart, hopefully, to get a Super Star Destroyer. We'll see. Walmart number one, Kowalski analysis. Percentage chance we walk away with Super Star Destroyer. Zero? Zero. Why are you even here? Debbie Downer. Well, that's a pretty cool display. Not gonna that lie. Is, yeah. um, I don't see what we came for though. Yeah, I think they've all been on it. They have definitely all been on the on the display thing. They do have a job. You said they wouldn't have a justifier. They have one. Actually, that's a lot less than most stores. We should keep our eye out for clearance too, because we saw that Falcon yesterday for half price, or at least oh, the price tag true, yeah. for it. No super star destroyer. Michael was right. He's was one right. and zero. He's one and zero. It's okay. We'll be back at another Walmart momentarily. All right, Michael, what are the odds for this store? A little better vibe here, but it, I'm putting that 5%. 5%? I don't see nothing Lego Star Wars out here. This is unbelievable. Throne room, 50 bucks. For 50 bucks, it's cheaper than the Costco prices. Have to buy it. So I ended up getting a throne room for 50 bucks. We're just waiting for Michael now. He's at the self-checkout. We're at a single entrance Walmart. What what are your percentage on this one? It's nice, but 10? 10%? That's higher than the other two. All right, 10% on Walmart here. We'll see. I mean, it's a $40 set probably. You need? It's like a good price. I don't know. It's got four figures inside maybe? I don't know. For my video. Oh yeah, you could. That's actually not a bad idea. <gasps> they have the snub fighter. Hey, oh. Should we try it? I mean, I don't need it. I didn't need the oh, super starter shorter. <laughs> You can try it if you want to get it. I don't see the Super Star Destroyer. Do you see a price tag for oh, yeah, Super Star Destroyer? It'd be 70, so. Um, this store, because this store is so small, honestly, it might just not carry that set. Oh, on our, like, true. seriously. Oh, this oh, is a shame. No, I know, but they still wouldn't carry everything. I know they have oh, big sets, but, seriously. like, they don't have the justifier, you know? Like, yeah. they don't carry everything. That might, that might honestly be the answer. Oh, that's so, such a shame. That's not the set we were looking for. I mean, we found a set early, which isn't bad, but it's not the set we were looking for. All right, good luck. Help is on the way, uh-oh. Oh my God. So they told Michael there was a recall on the item and they couldn't sell it, which but, sounds like a little white lie to me, but a lot better. Michael got something way better, absolutely. Oops. Look at that. Way better, no question. I'm gonna play with it in the bath. <laughs> you are not. McLaren, huh? Oh, is it really a McLaren? Oh my goodness. Make sure you guys subscribe so I can buy a McLaren. <laughs> <laughs> so we're at Target now and we found the Snub Fighter again. Michael's gonna- This is an illegal Lego set. <laughs> <laughs> Michael's gonna try to buy it again. We're gonna attempt number two. They got them stacked. Too. You're gonna be 0 for 2. Oh, I thought so. You're gonna be 0 for 2, guaranteed. This is quite a way to have a Lego section set up, right? <laughs> Very, sideways. very interesting. Yeah, sideways. Like you at least have the side box art, but they're not using it for some of them. I don't know. This is retired. Ooh, I think I have this one in my storage unit. Pretty sure. I need to open it. Yeah. They have some black series. They don't have the clone helmet yet. Oh, that one looks pretty dope. Luke, Ray, of course, very very rare Ray figure. Oh, I had this Dark Trooper one and decided I didn't like it, so I sold it. You get Ahsoka for free, so I'd be for stuck with, with her. Stuck with her? Oh, yeah. Take her off your hands. Dude, look at these Grievous. Look at that Grievous. That's pretty freaking dope. 475? Oh, man. There's one on here that's bigger and cheaper. 
Somehow they have Amazon exclusive pops. This is this. Are we secretly at Amazon? It's the Amazon warehouse. And they also have more Black Series, but I am stopping myself. I don't need to buy more Black Series right now. So we got the pick a brick that we bought at the Lego store throughout this vlog, as well as the Lego Land parts, which I think the yellow from these bags finally came off my hands. So that's good. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not kidding. <laughs> anyway, I've had these parts overflowing in this bin for a while. I've been needing to get a second bin for them. And then I'll also combine it with these that I just got at Legoland for Hoth. And so they should all fit in one. There's also like a lot of wasted space there. So maybe I'll try to flatten it out a little. But you know, pretty simple system I have here to just be able to make things work whenever I want to make them work. Flow into different bins and all that. Did I really buy more of these shield pieces that I don't need? I have way too many to begin Never with. Know. Oh my goodness. They're, they're like, I've seen really good stuff with them. So that's why I think I keep making myself think I'd use them one day, but I never will. You know, found more shields and I found more purple sparkly bricks. Where did those go? Did you move them? Okay. I thought they were over there. Okay. Perfect. Yes. We have more purple sparkly bricks. We're adding to the collection. Oh, baby. Big one here. We're going to sneak these in a mock somewhere. Absolutely. And it's got to look good. Ooh. Yeah. These are going in there. So we think we have a rare color here with nougat one by sixes and nougat two by fours. And Michael just had a reaction to finding out the price for the two by four. How much do these cost? So the cheapest new, they have 32 available. They want eight fifty five a brick. Eight dollars fifty five cents a brick. I'm rich. Oh, why did I get more? Oh my goodness. We need to go back. We've been making great progress. Michael has been very helpful. I wasn't really planning on doing any of this anytime soon. So Michael's just like, oh, let's sort parts. I'm like, oh, all right, <laughs> let's sort parts. So it's gone. What are we looking for? I feel like you have this. Oh, I definitely have that. Yeah. Um, these, I gotta find a better way to organize this closet. I need to get bins for these indie sets. They've been sitting in here for a month now. The last thing Michael and I are doing is we're building up my uh, previously sealed midi scale star destroyer. I've built the bottom half so far, and and I have the and I have the super star destroyer midi scale coming in tomorrow. So I had to get this built because I already have the other two over here. So I wanted to have all four for the video. And yeah, almost done though. Getting close. And the Mandalorian season three drops in about forty minutes, probably really thirty. They usually drop it early. The Mando season finale was uh, mid at best. Not a fan.